Alright, welcome on back, guys, to the next segment of Near Replicant. Um, so, we're gonna go ahead and. I'm gonna go ahead and do the, the, the third weapon. Um, I was gonna either go after the final. The final. Um, the final fragment, but I, I think I want to get this third weapon out of the way before I forget. Just knowing my dumb luck, I would, I'd forget. Oh, this is a new cutscene. The hell's this, sunshine? A letter. That thing wrote it for the postman. Ha! Man, that is some great A chicken scratch! She probably copied the letters as best she could. So, what's it say? Hey, what the hell? I think our friend's gonna wake up soon. Let's go. Who's our friend? Uh, seriously, who's, who's our friend? Yeah. When you were threatening that shade on the beach the other day, how did you know it was trying to protect the postman? Just a feeling, I guess. <laughs> All right. Hmm. So yeah, these um, one thing I'm going to uh, kind of for one you guys on is that these episodes might be a little wishy-washy. Um, I accidentally, when I made the second weapon for the, the Fool's Embrace episode, I did... Or no, not the Fool's Embrace, sorry. The Fool's Lament. I did accidentally say episode 46, so I decided to make that one episode 46. So that actually, I did record that before I did record Luis and then this one. So it's kind of well, one of the episodes it'll be like, I was level 33 and then the episode before it, I was level 34. It's like, okay, well, now you guys know what happened. I kind of made a boo-boo. And the only reason that there was even, or why I even said episode 46 to begin with was because I uh, I tried doing the Fool's the Lament episode and then I, uh, I kind of died a bunch and I was just like well I can't get through this so we decided to go ahead and just or I decided to go ahead and just uh, delete that episode and then um go and level up and stuff and now here we are going after the third weapon before you get the final fragment the diary yeah lately i haven't been able to stop thinking about it the world of the recycled vessel all right, let's see if I can do this. Um, I will admit, um, I've attempted this third door probably like 10 times, 10 or 11 times. Um, so with that being said, I should have stocked up on all this stuff. Oh, well, I'll do that while I'm explaining. So that being said, I attempted that door about 10 times on the hard difficulty I kept getting to to the fourth the third and the third and the fourth one I got to the fourth one once and then the third one like two or three times and then I know what you mean the others I just got freaking stuck on the second one so um that being said I did dial the difficulty back to to medium or to uh to normal um the enemies in this dlc 
I have so much freaking health. Like, the only way that I can kill them I worked. is if I use... Is if I use Shop a damage here. buff. And it's like... It's, it's just unrealistic. Like, these guys have, like, monster hunter health. Like, it's out of this world. So, I dialed it back to normal. Um... We're gonna see if I can get through it. I really would hate to dial it back to easy, but if I cannot get through it, that I'm, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, that's what's gonna happen because yeah, I am tired of trying this. We are so close to the to beating this game um, for for ending B or for route B, sorry. And it's like this is just a freaking brick wall. Like I'm just hitting it. I've, I've tried multiple different strategies. I, I don't know what I'm doing wrong. So, that or they, they just made this, this freaking, this door ridiculously hard. So, let's, let's try it on normal. See if we get anywhere. Uh, oh, wow. Holy sh- Yeah, we're not going to struggle with this at all. This almost feels like really easy. It's like I would sit here and fight these guys for like five minutes. And this is gonna be trivial. But hard, it was just like, man, these guys had so much health. I, I didn't understand it. What's up guys? I freaking love that you can activate that in midair. Okay, I almost feel like I'm just bullying now. But... If this is what it takes, this is what it takes. I've gone through this without getting hit. Normally I've gone through like five or six freaking... Five or six uh, healing items. There's only one right here. Okay, don't go too far because we'll get these guys and the other ones. Well, I guess in this one it doesn't matter. The way that I just two tap these guys. Look at that. Normally that and hard, that would have knocked me down to a quarter health. Well no, not a quarter health. Probably like three quarters health, sorry. I probably won't even need to do this for this guy. Like, I don't even need to use a freaking damage buff, man. Jeez. I oh, think you. I could use those. Not really. <laughs> and hard. I would probably have had, like, two or three of those left. What is it? Is it just gonna be U3? Or is it gonna be U3 plus the shades too? Yep. Yeah, see, like, they would probably be at like a 16th of their health bar gone. Not two of them almost dead. I'm gonna keep one of the boars alive. One thing that I did learn when doing this that I thought was kind of cool, when you activate your shield, and if you pay attention to the outer circle, the outer circle will flash when your shield's about to go. I don't know why, I just noticed it. I 
see right there is flashing. We'll see in like two hits of these guys would have knocked my shield out. This is ridiculous how huge the gap between the two difficulties, like how big the gap is. Like, I'm, we're looking at six minutes into this episode. I would probably be at like the 15 or 20 minute mark if I was on hard. This area is where actually where I got to on hard. To the last wave, and then I died. Wasn't there one you could go into? I don't know, was that only on hard or something? But I could go into this one. Oh, no, it's this one. See, there's also a difference in what spawns too. So, like back there at that door that I opened, there would be two armored, two armored shades. And I didn't see any armored shades. Yeah, none. Oh, here they are. Oh my gosh, man. The difference is unreal. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm kind of just saying the same shit over and over, but it's just like, wow. Like, this is, this is enjoyable, no? <laughs> the heart, I, I like playing it on hard. Oh, I think this was the room I was thinking of. Hold on. So okay, the spawns aren't too too diff different then, I guess. Kind of intrigued on how much damage that does to you. Because in, in hard, it would knock your it would break your shield, and then it would do about or knock you down to about quarter health. Ooh, titanium alloy. Seems we have been shut in. That's par for the course. I feel like I could on this I could just blindly swing and not even try. They barely, okay, they hit me and that was like barely even, like look at the amount of healing, holy shit man, like I was, it would, it would take me like five or six rooms to even get like half of this. We're gonna fight number six. Moldavite, hell yeah. I don't know why I thought that was a box. <laughs> I guess it kind of looked like one. Oh yeah, it's gonna be number six. This is, well, at least this is where you fought number six. I shouldn't say it's gonna be number six. This is where we fought. 
the ultimate weapon. And I'm almost wondering if I didn't put it on easy. That or this weapon is just crazy OP. See, I'm just so used to these guys hitting hard as a freaking rock or hitting like a brick. I'm, I'm gonna let them swing that at me and see what happens. Oh, I interrupted it. I think this is what I should have done for for this. Uh... Yeah, see, like that would have knocked me down to like a quarter. I think this is what I should have done at, at the beginning of of Route B. Is I look back to normal. Weapon collector, obtain the spear, fools accord, and five health cells. I think we have one more. Man, you call that armor? What the hell? Finish him. Get parried, bitch. I parried it and still took damage. I can't see shit, so let's reposition. Oh, I see something gold. Okay. I don't mind flying. Not one of these guys? Wow. That's all she wrote. Well, that was really nice. That was actually relaxing.
What's the last? I think this is the last area. I thought there was five per. All right, let's do this, guys. I saw that little backflip over there. You just knock that shit off. Okay, drop down. Yeah. Drop down here. Downward thrust! Fling anybody off? Oh, I didn't fling them off, but I did send them flying. That was really weird. I had that thing all the way charged up. Alright, you son of a bitch. I hate these things with a passion. Did he? He did die! I was like, did he just die? <laughs> I don't know which, what's my least favorite shade, if it's them or if it's the other one. The really, like, heavily armored one. With the spike club. He interrupted my damn wall. I think this is... Okay, so another mini-boss. Okay. Oh, jeez. Look at that health. Just... Diminish. And the third one? Okay, he's got a little more health. Okay, that hurt a little bit. He's got no armor on that arm anymore. He's dead. Fourth? What am I doing? Just going through all the different fucking bosses? Looks like it. Oh man, he's getting parried to uh, Kingdom Come.
10,000 XP points. And wow, 50,000 gold. Sheesh. Dreaming vessel in a recycled world. Until the time of its awakening comes. Saving system data saved. Hell yeah. Was that the recycled world? Could be all of it. Is that all? Huh? Is that the final entry of the diary? It seems that way. Interesting. You figure anything out? I fear not. Yeah, I'm not surprised. All right. Okay, so we got all the weapons. Um. Yeah, weapons. Uh, we got the trophy for it. Yeah, weapon collection 100%. Side quest, there's a couple I didn't give a shit about. Um, and then words were only at 50%. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and save, and then we will wrap this episode up. And go and wrap up and, uh, Route B. All we have to do is go and get the final uh, fragment. But thanks for tuning in, guys. I'll see you in the next one.